The stock was $4.80 back in June, roughly June of 2020. And this is before the split and, and all that. Uh, and uh, that would be like the equivalent of a dollar twenty today, by the way. Four eighty at the time is like a buck twenty. And uh, I kept coming out with GameStop videos, maybe once a month or so. Uh, I bring out another one about this and that. Then I came across the Ryan Cohen story: how Ryan Cohen was buying up the shares of GameStop, and I thought, oh. Ho, 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 ho. Oh, this short squeeze. There's all this talk about a short squeeze on GameStop. It's going to happen. And sure enough, um, it took a few months. Uh, a lot of people thought it would happen instantly. Uh, but no, no, no. It, it took a little while to catch. And it did take off uh, in, in December and then uh, January of 2021. And at, at that time, I started going live to answer questions for folks curious about how the markets worked and how this was happening and why was this going on. And of course, the GameStop shares were running and running and um, all kinds of craziness happened. If you've watched the movie Dumb Money, uh, I if you haven't watched the movie Dumb Money, I would recommend you do watch the movie uh, Dumb Money. There's a there's a flyer right there. Uh, what looks like. You should watch this movie. Uh, this is... Um, fairly accurate uh, from a few angles as to what was going on in uh, January, February, March, April of 2021. Uh, this channel right here, um, I had 1,400 subscribers in December 2020. And uh, in March 2021, I had 106,000 subscribers of this channel. Mm -hmm. 